I guess you've been wondering where I've been for the last couple of months, so stay tuned until the end of this episode and you'll be able to hear all about it. Welcome to another episode of Viva La Film. We're here in Circular Key today. We're going to take a ferry to Manly and we're going to be shooting with the Canon A1 program. Come with us. Complex has just fallen asleep. I think the uh, boat ride was a little bit too exciting.
So we're back from our ferry trip to Melly. I had so much fun shooting this camera. I'm gonna go develop the role now. Let's talk about the camera when we get inside. It's been a couple of months since we shot with the Canon A1 program. I love this camera. Uh, not as much as I love my FM2. There's a couple of things I would like to address before I go. As you know, guys, I don't run a review channel. This is just my thoughts. But if you do have any comments, please leave them down below. Uh, the Canon A1 program is a really good camera for beginner film photographers, also for experienced film photographers because you can shoot it in fully manual, uh, but you can also shoot it in aperture priority, shutter priority, or in completely program mode, which like will let the camera do most of the work for you. I couldn't do that with my Canon A1 because as you can hear now, I have this squeaky problem. So that means my shutter is working a little bit slower than what it's actually telling me that it is. So, so if I have it in 250, it's probably shooting at about 125. Uh, so what I had to do to shoot my Canon A1 in completely manual mode. Uh, so I, my shutter speed was up to 150, so I wouldn't be shooting any slower than 125, so I wouldn't get camera shake. And whatever the camera told me it was the right aperture, I will open one more. So if it told me that the right aperture was f4, I was shooting f2.8. Uh, and that way I got away with like, you know, maybe my shutter speed getting a little bit slower. And if you do come from a Nikon setup and you're moving into a Canon setup, one thing to actually have in mind though is that the lenses focus the opposite way. Yeah, they do. So I, I actually shoot my Nikon FM2 so much that I just like, I know my brain just knows which way to go with the lens. Uh, to focus really fast. I actually lost a couple of pics that I could have taken uh, on that trip because I wasn't fast enough focusing because I was actually focusing backwards. Uh, so uh, with the Nikon I said that you go in this way and out this way and with the Canon is the opposite way you go in this way and out this way. So uh, it's something to have in mind that if you are moving from a Nikon setup to a Canon setup uh, have in mind that you will have to learn how to focus again or your brain will have to get used to it. The Canon A1 program is an amazing camera guys. I'm not going to talk it up too much. Uh, if you want to see a, you know, a technical review about the Canon A1 you can go into YouTube. There's heaps of other people that have technical reviews and tell you what each button is for each thing. Overall, an amazing camera. Like I said before guys, uh, I'm sorry I haven't been uh, uploading videos for a couple months. It's been actually about three months since the last video and I'm sorry. I've been super busy. As you guys know, I opened up a shop here in Sydney, Newtown. I went over to South America, stay in South America for like a bit over a month with my family. And then when I came back, I had to close the shop. Yes, I had, uh, new people bought the premises. It was just not the right shop for me anymore. They have moved everything around. They, uh, they have split my space into two corners and it was just not working for me. Uh, so uh, if you guys know anybody in Newtown that has a coffee shop or in Sydney that has a coffee shop that might want to come and go, uh, yeah, leave me a comment down below. But like I said, I'm at the moment, I'm looking for a space. Uh, we are about to open a web store. I've been working really hard cataloging all the cameras. Been super busy. So uh, from this week onwards, hopefully I'll be able to start uploading every week again. Please comment below if you have any questions about the camera. If you think I did anything wrong, please comment below. I'm happy to start any conversations. If you guys have any uh, any any tips or stuff that you want to let other people know about the Canon A1, please leave them below. If you did like this video though, guys, please hit that like. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already uh, tell your friends about the channel because we just hit a thousand yeah that's 1k uh, there'll be a giveaway coming up really soon and I'm um, thank you so much for guys for sticking with me uh, thank you for uh, subscribing to the people that have already subscribed a thousand followers I never thought I'd get here so yeah like I said I'll be uploading again next week and until then grab a camera roll roll and have some fun and I'll see you guys next time